What's going on, YouTube? I'm uh, back here with a video today. And I apologize, it's been a while since I've uploaded. Um, but let's get to the point here. Uh, Razor Synapse has an update, and that was pretty loud. Anyway, here I'm showing you uh, this website. It's called mtgarena.pro. Um, this is a fantastic tool that um, I found on Reddit today. It's by a user named Razviar. I uh, will uh, link to this page in the description. Uh, go give this man an upvote because this is amazing. This is incredible. Um, this is totally free. And uh, as it says here, magic decks and services. Uh, this is a utility that you can um, use to uh, it, uh, just sh look at your collection. Um, it's a deck building tool. Uh, you can do a lot of things with it. You can uh, export. You can build decks here and then export them into MTG uh, Arena. Um you can uh, look at other decks that people have built, but it'll all show, also show you um, like an estimation on how many packs you'll need to open, booster packs you'll need to open to build this deck, assuming you don't have any of the cards in your collection. Um, but not only can you do those things, but I think the greatest feature on here is um, the fact that you can filter by expansion. So I know, personally for myself, when Kaladesh and Aether Revolt were added to the game, I only wanted to look at the new cards that I got because they gave so many free cards out. Um, and so having a feature like this is fantastic because now when I get new, uh, like a set of new cards comes out like that, um, say maybe down the road they decide to introduce uh, sets that are in modern, not just standard. They decide to add old sets of the game. I imagine they'll probably do something similar where they will give you play sets of certain cards because otherwise how it would be nearly impossible to to fill your collection and be able to use those cards. So, um, yeah, being able to sort by set here is great. I just think that's the, the coolest feature um, that's available on here. So, uh, like I said, I will leave a link here in the description uh, to the Reddit page, and then uh, also here is the, uh, the main page for the website. Um, he's got the uh, deck builder page here, uh, not deck builder, it's under my arena, deck tracker. Uh, when you go to this page, this will give you all the information for you to download. Um, you'll need uh, to, you'll need the net framework here, but you, you probably already have it, and if you don't, he's got the install link for it there, no big deal. Um, so you'll just click this link here, this will take you to the downloader. Uh, you'll want to save that. Uh, it's going to come in a zip file, and then uh, when you download it, um, you'll need to extract it. Uh, if you don't extract it, it won't run properly, so I've got it in here somewhere. Nope. Mm. Maybe I don't. Maybe I deleted it. Either way, you extract it. Um, I just extracted it to a folder on my desktop. Just made a folder for it on my old desktop here. And uh, extract both the tracker and the DLL file. He says that uh, down here, do not remove the DLL. If you don't use the, have the DLL in the same folder with the, uh, the application, it won't work. So, um, but otherwise, it doesn't matter what directory you put the, de the folder in. It just has to be anywhere in a folder with those two items in the same folder. And then you'll uh, run that as the application. Um, when you open it up, it'll tell you that you don't have a to you'll need your token. So to get your token, you'll go to My Arena, click My Collection. Which, by the way, when you first come to the website, it'll ask you to register. It's completely free. Just uh, sign in. I signed in with the... Uh, I used both the email address and my in-game name um, for my login credentials uh, when I registered. So I would recommend doing that. Um, that's probably with the email address is probably how it uh, is able to gather your collection, but I'm not sure if the username makes a difference. Um, but you'll uh, register. Go to After you've downloaded it, you'll go to uh, My Collection. Click Import Collection. It'll pop up your token. You just copy this. Copy go back in here, paste it, and then it'll say game info found, it'll show up your, it'll show your thing somewhere, maybe. Last time when I logged into it, it showed my, uh, it showed my username, but that doesn't matter, you just minimize it, I, uh, it tracks your information, uh, like card database, uh, in real time, so if you leave it minimized and it'll be running in the background, if you, um, if you're playing Magic, 
and you open a booster pack and you get new cards that you didn't already have in your collection, it will real-time automatically update the information on the website here. And then uh, you can use whatever features you want. You can go into your deck builder. You can, uh, like I said, sort by expansion. Maybe I want to build a, a mono red uh, deck that's got only Kaladesh and Aether Revolt. So I can go in and I can filter these. I'm not sure if I can select more than one set at a time, but you can do all sorts of cool stuff. So I find it uh, really neat. You can export your decks um, and other decks that you come across on here. You can go into them and export them and uh, save them on Arena. You'll have an idea of how many booster packs you'll need, or uh, I think there's somewhere that it'll show you... Um, Yeah, so it shows me here, looking at this deck, I have all of the cards except for the ones that have the minus two. So it shows he's running four Teferis in this deck. I only have two Teferis in my collection. I don't have Approach. I don't have any Settles. So it shows you what cards you have and how many you don't have of the ones that you don't have. So, I mean, it doesn't get much better than this, folks. Export, copy it, then you just import it in-game. I don't have my game open at the moment, but that's all it is. Try for yourselves. I highly recommend it. I think it's a fantastic tool. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, sorry that I forgot your name, RazVR. I already gave you my upvote. This is solid work, and it's fantastic to see something like this be introduced for free. Totally free. So, thanks for watching the video. Like I said, please go to Reddit. Give this guy th uh, an upvote. If, if anything, just to uh, kind of increase visibility so that other people on Reddit will be able to see this. It won't get buried and become an old post. And, uh, yeah. And if you like the video, please consider subscribing and giving me a thumbs up. Um, I'd like it for as many people to be able to see this as possible on YouTube. I'm not a lot, I'm not, you know, there's a lot of people that play the game that probably aren't on Reddit. So, uh, f as much visibility on this website I uh, I don't need any of the credit. This is all this guy's work, and I just think it's solid. I want everybody to know about it because it's such a good tool. Thanks for watching.